and Gloria's always so friendly with people. I didn't know that those were talents. Uh -huh. Talents are all the special things you do well. They're part of what makes you, you. And you should make the most of your talents. How? By thinking about what you're good at. By practicing what you're good at. And by being proud of what you can do. Using your talents can make you feel good about yourself. I feel good about myself. You know, you two were a big part of Iggy's tape. It can be just as important to put your talents together with others as it is to do it on your own. <laughs> right, Ig? That's right, Holly, because I needed you all to help me. Hi, everybody, it's me, Chuck, Chuck Chickadee. Hi, Chuck. Oh, hi, Holly, I've got something for you. You'll never guess what it is. Oh, well, now, what have we here? It's an invitation, Holly, an invitation. But who could it be from? Well, from me, and from my little sister Chelsea. Aunt Charlotte wrote it out for us. Open it up. Well, I'll just do that. Oh! Uh, <laughs> dear Holly, Iggy, Jacob, and Gloria, you are cordially invited to a surprise party in honor of the 15th wedding anniversary of Mr. and Mrs. Chester and Charlene Chickadee. Oh, that's my mom and dad. <laughs> The party will be held a week from today at 34 Spring Street, under the umbrella tree. Under the umbrella tree? The party's going to be here? Surprise! That is a surprise. Why, well, it's the only way Chelsea and I can keep all the getting ready a secret from Mom and Dad. Wow, a surprise anniversary party. What a great idea, Chuck. Yeah, yeah. What is an anniversary, anyway? An anniversary is when every year on the same day you remember something that happened. Sort of like a birthday. Yeah, and this time we're remembering the day my mom and dad got married 15 years ago. But you know, Chuck, a big party like this would take a lot of work. Oh, I know, Holly, but you guys are really good at giving parties, and I'll help, I really will, so please, Holly, please, 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 please. Well, it would take a real team effort. What do you say? I could play my piano for dancing. Oh, that'd be great, Gloria. Mom and Dad were Chickadee Charleston champions three years in a row. I could play my drums and help decorate. Party decorations are my speciality. Oh, could we have some of those little squeaky noisemakers, Holly? I think we already have, Chuck. What do you say, Iggy? Hmm? Oh, sure, Hall. I'll help. Although, once the record stores hear my song, I may not have a lot of free time. Well, I... Guess it's okay. Hooray! 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 Hooray. No, no. I I'm sure he'll understand. Well, he's only been trying for a few days. Well, perhaps another time. Right, I'll tell him. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Oof. This songwriting thing may not be going as well as Iggy had hoped. Hello, Holly. Was that for me? I'm expecting some very important call. Iggy, there's a message for you from Sam Snappy Songs. Whoa. They are not interested in your song at this time. Oh. I'll just put it over here with all the other messages from people who aren't interested. All those? Oh, not to worry, Holly. A uh, momentary setback. That's the spirit. Well, I'm off to visit the record stores. I know they'll want to hear my song. Oh, well, Iggy, if you're going out, would you stop mm -hmm. at the gift shop for me? We're going to need some supplies for the surprise party. Okay, party supplies. No problem. No matter how big I get, Holly, I'll always have time to do things for my little friend. Well, thank you, Iggy. I'm glad to hear you Must say run. that. Must run. Ta-ta for now. <laughs> of the dance music that Jacob and I will be playing at the party, Holly. Oh, let's see, Gloria. Mm -hmm. It's going to be great. Oh, yes. It's great. Mm -hmm. If I Had Two Worms, I'd Give You One by Loretta Loon. Oh, yeah. How romantic, Jacob. Oh, it is, if you're a bird. You know, there's something else we should be thinking about. Anniversaries are a time to give presents. What kind of presents? Well, all kinds. Chuck and Chelsea are giving a special photograph of themselves to their mom and dad. Oh, Mr. and Mrs. Chickadee will love a picture Ooh. of Chuck and Chelsea. Mm. They've probably never seen them standing still before. But what are we going to give? Mm. <gasps> I know. Wait right here. I think Jacob just got an idea. Looks like a big one. 
Here it is, right here in Nest and Gardens magazine. This is what we should give Mr. and Mrs. Chickadee. What is it? A bird bath? Yeah, a brand new super deluxe bird bath with a whirlpool and everything. We could build that. I know. The plans are right there in the magazine. We could build it together. I could do the construction work. I could do the painting and the decorating. And I could help, too. And what would be nicer than a homemade gift? Yeah. Let's do it. Well, that's settled, then. Uh, what else do we need? We need a cake. A great big gooey one. I could help you make a cake, Holly. Thanks, Jacob. And we'll need food. Lots of food. Oh, and paper streamers and balloons. And a big sign that says, Happy Anniversary. Wow. You weren't kidding when you said there was a lot of work that goes into planning a party. When you want to get things done, you gotta get it together. When you want to have some fun, you gotta get it together. If you wanna play in tune, shine just like a moon in June, you better get together right now, right now. If you want to join the team, you gotta get it. Get along like Beach and Queen, gotta get it together. Don't get left out in the rain, all aboard the good time train. You better get together right now, right now. Get it, won't you get it, won't you get it, won't you get it, won't you get it together. Get it, won't you get it, won't you get it, won't you get it, won't you get it. I know that girl. That's Jory Steinberg. She lives next door to Mrs. McMurtry. Oh, she's a terrific singer. I bet she'll be a big star someday. I'm gonna say hello. Hi, Jory. Hi, Iggy. What are you doing here? Oh, I came by to pick up some party supplies for Holly. How about you? I needed some ribbons for a costume. I'm going tomorrow for a big talent audition. That's a tryout. And if I sing well, I'll get to be on Reach for a Star. Ooh, the TV program? Isn't that the one where you get to do your act and if they really like you, they make you a star? Wow. But first, I have to try out to be on the show. I'm a bit nervous. Oh, you'll do great. Joy will be easy. Piece of cake. Well, actually, Iggy, being a performer and singing and acting and all that is hard work. I take singing lessons three times a week and I practice every day. Ah, no kidding. Oh, I know you'll get to be on the show. I hope so, Iggy. Sure. I'm sure going to give it my best try. Yeah. Hey, what are all those tapes you're carrying? Huh? Oh, oh, these, well, they're uh, tapes of a song I wrote. <laughs> really? Yeah. Can yeah. I listen to one? Uh, oh, yeah, sure, here, take one. Thanks. Ah, uh, you're welcome. Well, I better be going. I've got a lot more practicing to do before my big audition. Bye, Iggy. Okay, bye, Jory. Hey, good luck. Thanks. <laughs> oh, dear, dear, dear. <laughs> No, he's not, my dear fellow. Hi, Mr. Fuller. Welcome to my humble store, gifts and gimmicks, where the cream of the crop I love to shop. Oh, dear, dear, dear. Ah. Uh -huh. So, tell me, dear boy, what have you been up to lately? Well, I've written a terrific song. Say, maybe you'd like to play it in your store. Uh, people could hear it and know how great it is. What a charming idea. <laughs> Have you a tape with you? Whoa, sure, uh, right here. All set to go into the tape player. Yeah, excellent. Yeah, you just have to be a little careful. <laughs> uh, no, M Mr. Fuller, I... I, I... <laughs> oh, boy. I say, oh, dear, dear, dear. There appears to be a small snarl in this tape. Not so chat. Yeah, right. Uh, thanks anyway, Mr. Fuller. Uh, but perhaps there is something I can do to help you. After all, show business is my life. It is? Really? Ah, yes. Shopkeeping is just a little something I do to keep busy between theatrical engagements. Ah, no kidding. How long has it been since your last show? <laughs> 30 years. <clears throat> uh, due in part to an unfortunate fortunate accident with an opera singer, some scenery, and a bass drum. Ah, oh, tough break. Exactly. But never mind. 
all part of the excitement of life upon the stage. <laughs> oh, I say, dear, dear, dear. But, Mr. Fuller, how can you help me? Experience, dear boy. And from my experience, I can tell you that you need a gimmick. A gimmick? What's that? A look, a style, something that makes people notice you right away. Well, I kind of hope my music would do that. Not another word, dear boy. You're in good hands now. Oh, dear. I was afraid of that. <laughs> Okay, I'm just going to read through the recipe to make sure I know exactly what I'm doing. Oh, you go ahead, Hall. Okay. Uh, in a large bowl... In a large bowl... Large bowl. Um, okay, here we go. Oh! 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 Jacob, huh? that's enough drumming for now, okay? Oh, uh, sure, Hall. <laughs> just getting a little practice. Good, good. All right. Now, cake. Okay. Mm, okay. Uh, wow. flour. Okay, that's mm -hmm. all measured out. I know. Sugar. And, uh... Jacob! Huh? What are all those little things in there? In there? Bird seed, huh? Bird seed? Yeah, of course. What's an anniversary cake without bird seed? Mm -mm. Well, I guess it is a chickadee anniversary cake. Yep. Okay, uh, now where was I? Um, okay, Jacob, how would you like to put in the baking powder? No problem. Three huh? teaspoons, okay? Three teaspoons. All right, no problem. The important thing about cake baking is to be very careful about the measuring. Just put exactly in the amount the recipe calls. <coughs> <coughs> Jacob! <coughs> huh? Did you put three teaspoons of baking powder in there? Oh, at least, huh? Jacob, why don't what? you just... Talk to me while I do a little measuring. You know, sort of keep me company. Oh, okay, Ho. <laughs> sure, boy, this party stuff sure is exciting. I can hardly wait for when the chickadees arrive and we all get to yell, Surprise! Oh. Uh, sorry, Ho. Uh, oh, I guess I just have a talent for making a mess. No, 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 Jacob. No, it's just... Uh, Jacob, what, what's that little decoration you're wearing just under your apron. Oh, that. I made it, Hall. It's one of my party decorations. Do you like it? Like it? I, I, I love it. Huh. It's wonderful, Jacob. Huh. You know what? what? Why don't I continue on with this cake baking and, and leave you to do what you do best? What's that? Party decorations. Oh, yeah. They I are your spissy alley day. <laughs> One of your talents. Oh, I guess. As um, a matter of fact, uh, Iggy was going to stop and pick up some party supplies on his way home today. Why don't you go meet him and give him a hand? Yeah, sure, Hall. I could do that. Yeah. Uh, are you sure you can manage without me, though? I'll try. Huh. Okay. I say, oh, dear, dear, dear. Oh, hi, Mr. Fuller. Jacob, dear chap. How very nice to see you. Huh. Uh, I came to help Iggy get the party stuff for the Chickadee's surprise party. Is he here yet? Uh, not only Iggy, but the new huh? improved Iggy. What? I give you Igna, the soon-to-be recording megastar. Oh, Iggy, is that you? It used to be. Well, what happened to you? I got a gimmick. Oh, gee, that's too bad, Egg. Maybe Dr. Willoughby can help. No, no, it's his new look, Jacob. With a look like this, he'll attract so much attention that he'll be at the top of the music charts in no time. Uh, I don't know, Mr. Fuller. Oh, don't I... try and thank me, dear boy. Is there any other way I can be of service? Well, we need some really special decorations for the anniversary party. Polly's counting on me to be the expert decorator. It's my speciality day. Perhaps I can suggest something from the display over here. Uh, uh oh, oh uh, uh, maybe we should get it, Mr. Fuller. Yeah, yeah, we could do that. Nonsense, yeah, boy. Allow me. I'll just reach up there. Oh. I say, oh, dear, dear, dear. <laughs> 
Will that be all? What? Gloria, the bird bath is looking terrific. Thanks, Holly. Oh, that'll be Mitzi. She's going to help me with the whirlpool part of the bird bath. <laughs> Come on in, Mitzi. Hi, Gloria. Hi, Holly. Hi, Mitzi. Are you ready to test the whirlpool? Uh-huh. I'm even wearing my bathing suit. Great! It's a really nice bathing suit, too. Gee, thanks! Well, while you two work on the bath, I'm going to get started on the little towels to go with it. Okay, Holly. Now, Mitz, let's turn the water on and fill up the bird bath. Okay. Hmm, that's funny. What's the matter? Oh, it doesn't work. I'd better check underneath. You keep watching and tell me when the water comes out. All righty. <laughs> Anything mm -hmm. yet? No. How about now? <laughs> oh, sorry, Mitz. <laughs> oh, that's okay. <laughs> My nose is already cold and wet. What now, Gloria? Well, you get in, and I'll turn on the whirlpool, and the water should go round and around and around in circles. All right. I'm going to turn it on, okay? <laughs> too fast? Uh, no, that was a lot too fast. How's it going? Well, um, we still have a few things to work out, but we're going to start sticking the tiles on the bath next. Ah, well, I suggest you do your gluing out on the deck. It could get messy. Okay, Holly. Come on, Mitt. Hi, Hall. We got the decorations. Well, got them. Great. And these. Oh, dear. Let me have a look, Iggy. Not interested in your song at this time. That's oh! Hopeless. Nobody wants my song. Nobody cares about my song. Maybe I'll never have a song published. Maybe I'll never be good at anything. Maybe I just have no talent at all. Oh, Iggy. Come here. Iggy, you don't need all this silly, gimmicky stuff. Well, Mr. Fuller said it would help me get noticed. All it got me was a seat on the bus. Nobody wanted to sit beside me. Iggy, talent is a very special thing. Sometimes it's hard to get people to appreciate what you do. It can take time. Oh, no, no kidding! But the important thing is to go on believing in yourself. And don't let anybody try to turn you into something you're not. You think I should keep on trying? Absolutely. Listen. You're hoping and wishing and doing your best. You're wondering what more you can do. Just go on believing your star will start shining. And soon it could happen to you. A lot. Yeah, thanks, Paul. You're welcome. In fact, I, I think I'll go help Jake with the decorations. Okay, off okay. you go. <laughs> Hello? Oh, hi, Jory. How are you? You did? 
You're kidding. Jory, that's wonderful. Congratulations. No. Really? Jory, that is terrific news. I... Okay, I won't say a word. I'll let you tell him. Okay. All right, until then. Bye. Our guests of honor. Oh, Holly dear, such a lovely party. Such beautiful decorations. Such wonderful music. However Ever did, did you, you do, do it? it? We all did it, and it was our pleasure. You're all so talented. We have a special gift for you. Oh, my, for us. Oh, how can we ever thank you for this beautiful bird bath? Yes, Al's have letter C, C for chickity. Oh, 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 and there's even a little bath mat, so we won't slip, my dear. Chickadees can be very slippy, you know. Very slippy. Well, I'm just so glad you're pleased. Oh, my goodness, Chester, but cake. It's just one big excitement after another. Oh, it is. I'm all a flutter. I'm all a twitter. Oh, dear, dear, dear. Well, I see Mr. Fuller made it. Unfortunately, I can't say the same for our flower vase. How are you doing, Iggy? Oh, I'm okay, Holly. I've decided to keep trying, and even if I can't be a recording star, I can still enjoy my music and be proud of it. You sure can. <laughs> oh, um, could you get that, Iggy? Oh, sure, Hall. Although I don't know who it could be. Everybody and his dog is here already. Oh, hi, Jory. Come on in. Hi, Iggy. Hey, hey, hey. How was your audition? I have to talk to you. Uh, oh, yeah, sure. Iggy, this is it. My big break. I'm going to be on Reach for the Stars. Wow, you did well at the audition? Yes. Isn't that great? Oh, gee, Jory, I'm really glad for you. But, Iggy, there's more. I'm going to be singing a song by a new songwriter. Oh, new songwriter, hey, that's great for him or her. No, Iggy, Whoever it is. you understand, the new songwriter is you. Yeah, it's me. Me? Me? I listened to your song on the tape and it was just right for me. Is it all right with you by singing it on television? All right? <laughs> all right. Hey, Polly, everybody, listen to this. Jory's going to sing my song on television. We know, Iggy. Jory asked us to keep it a secret so she can tell you herself. So, what do you think, Iggy? Is it okay? Well, I think it's more than okay. It... Hey, in fact, why don't you try it out on everybody right now? Come on. Oh, oh yes, yes, yes indeed. Would you, Jory? We'd love to hear it. Especially Iggy. Yeah, it would add so much to our anniversary party. Oh, my, yes, indeed. Sing, oh. sing, sing. Well, you said it would work out, didn't you, Holly? Well, I guess I just have a talent for recognizing talent. Yeah. <laughs> I believe that I can make a difference in everything I do. I believe that I can go the distance to make my dreams come true. There's a little light that shines inside me, showing me the way. There's a little voice that tells me to dream on every single day. Everyone has something special, each in their own way. It's something to be proud of every day. If you do your best with what you've got and give it your best shot, you'll feel better just for trying. And you could reach the top All I want is a little chance All I need is a bit of luck All I want is to show the world 